All right, let's get into it. The Nissan 2021 Armada. Very big, very strong. It has a V8 engine with 400 pounds of torque. You also have a seven speed transmission. But look at the exterior portion of it. If you look at the grill, you have sensors as well. But this thing is tough. Welcome to the Salty Spittoon. How tough are you? How tough am I? How tough am I? I had a bowl of nails for breakfast this morning. <laughs> yes, yeah, so? Without any milk. Uh, right this way, sorry to keep you waiting. So let's go to the side of the vehicle. I got a few key features I wanna show you. Let's start with the wheels. So we have a 22 inch machine face wheels. It's also accompanied by ventilated disc brakes. What that does is it cools down the brake throughout its brake cycle, keeping the integrity of the brake. This vehicle is kind of tall. I'm about five foot seven, so this thing sits a little bit higher than me, about three inches more. So you're looking at about five, 10, six feet. So it does come with a stepping rail. It's very nice because it is a tall sitting vehicle. So having that stepping rail kind of gets you in there nice and snug. All right, at the top of this as well, it comes with a moonroof. So you get to see the beautiful sky as you're driving. It also comes with a rail as well. So for those of you who like to travel, you can put some bags up there, strap it down. And it also comes with keyless entry. So I can just come up to this vehicle, have the key right in my pocket. I can just open up that door. Nice and easy, no issues. All right, let's go to the back of the vehicle. Let me show you a few more key features. Pretty cool, right? This is all electrical. So it does all the work for you. If you look at the inside as well, we also have some moving seats as well. So come over here and swing on the side. Again, electrical pieces again. You don't have to do all that work of fidgeting and try to close in it manually. It does all the work for you as well. You just gotta go ahead and press that button. You have the seats belts located at the top and as well to the left hand side on the driver's side. Another cool feature here. So if you look over here at the top, I can go ahead and close that, but as well I can lock the rest of the vehicle. So you don't have to go to your pocket and lock it or manually go through locking all the doors. You can go ahead and press that button and then close that just like that. Voila, it will do it for you. All right, so let's take a step inside. Before I do that, I wanna show you the interior of the car door. It has a few features that I wanna show you. So here we have seat presets. So if those of you who have spouses or maybe a child of driving age, let's say they go inside of your car and they start messing with the car seat, you can go ahead and click on that first button there and then it'll adjust it right back to where you left off at. All right, so many interesting things to talk about. Let's get into it. Let's talk about the rear view mirror. I know this is not your regular rear view mirror. This thing lights up as well as connects with Homelink. For those of you who do have it, you could set that up. Let's talk about the seven inch display. It's touchscreen, so you can go ahead and click on it and maneuver it that way. You also have some knobs right below it as well. And if you wanna connect with your smartphone, like an iPhone or an Android, you can go ahead and do that. You have, of course, your USB charging ports, but check this out. Nissan added on a wireless pad. So you can go ahead and put your phone on there and it'll charge your phone. All right, let's talk about the steering wheel. It is absolutely nice. Luxurious finish, it has the leather with the stitching. Again, the middle console has that as well. I love it. As well as, it has all these controls, all these bells and whistles at the middle, so you don't have to reach across to the digital dashboard while you're driving. You have most of the controls here. Also has the digital dashboard at the front end where your speedometer is at, so it tells you all the functions that you're using. Here, the middle console, you have some controls like tow mode or snow, um, traction control as well. You also have a knob here to spin to elect certain things on the display. You have map voice. I love this because I know when I'm driving, when I hear that map voice, sometimes it get a little bit annoying or overpowering to the music. I can just turn that off when I'm just cruising. You also have camera mode. A lot of vehicles don't have this. It automatically turns on for you. This one, you can manually press it if you need to. So if you click on this, boom, it'll show you the exterior of the vehicle. Very nice. All right, let's talk about the rest of the car. All right, the moonroof. Very nice again, I love it. Has a luxurious feel again to it. If you look at the backspace of it, we have six seatings. That's not including the middle portion section where the seats are. You can also move the middle part to get more space and you can walk all the way to the back. Also another cool feature is you can put whatever video you want on the back head seats where the driver sides are. I think this is very nice. Again, for those of you who have kids, you know, or you have guests, or you're going through a long traveling period, you could put that on, and it's just entertaining to have. All right, so there you have it, the Nissan 2021.
2021 Armada here at Jenkins Nissan dealership. We hope you come along for the ride.